Hello, my brothers and sisters, my ladies and my misters, or whatever you may prefer. Welcome back, back to the place that we call home, or as the outsiders would like to call it, the barge. Now salvation comes from hydration. Or is it just that this hydration gives us the ability to ease ourselves back? Back to the time when love and acceptance were all we knew, before the world started expecting things of us. I look out and I see some new faces, or some old faces that I don't remember. Whichever it may be, welcome. Welcome to a place where we're free of labels that society has pinned on us. You dregs and deadbeats, burnouts and stoners, losers, as they would call you, who will amount to nothing in our shit for nothing lives. Nothing. That is who we are. And that makes us exactly who we should be. Now enjoy this night, my family, for it is going to be one we'll hope we remembered. And don't forget to give a little something back to the barge. Amen. For the last time, we do not say that here. Shutter night, huh, Carl? Come on, Carl. You had to have heard something I was saying out there. I thought it was. I thought it was great. Did they do something bad again? Fuck you, Miles. Well, my people are calling. So. I'm gonna go, as you put it, have more fun. Maybe, see you out there. people, man. Is everyone gone? Uh, fucking finally. Alright, be on in a second. Hey, Carl, uh... I think someone pissed on the floor again. Not a big deal. Are you really that fucking stupid? You could have put us on the radar. The radar? Yes, the radar. Local reporters, the police. Maybe the IRS or the, the Catholic Church, who the fuck knows? Would you care to explain to me what I did to upset you? Come on, you know I haven't read since grade school. In what used to be known as Felipe's Place, a new phenomenon has been growing since the passing of owner Felipe Sanchez. This new spiritual revolution in the works is captivating those who visit the defunct dive bar turned church. However, the heart of what is known as the barch may be fraudulent. Oh, whatever. Who's gonna believe something written in the Herald anyway? Who even reads the Herald? This is just your typical fake news. The self-proclaimed minister of love and peace, formerly known as Miles McMurphy 
is like a knockoff brand version of Jim Jones. Just lacking all the charm. As if I'm a knockoff. After my rambunctious night at a service for the Barch, the greasy minister joked to me, if you want to be a millionaire, start a cult. Wait, how did they get that quote? That was supposed to be in private. It was just me and some other girl here. It was supposed to be off the record. Did you say it was off the record? Uh, of course I did. Maybe I did. Shit, I don't remember. Regardless, this is libel. We can sue them for libel. Who are they to slander our good name? The Barch's good name. Unbelievable. We're being painted out to be frauds. Who cares? It's not like our followers are gonna stop coming in anyway. And plus, fraud built this country, so... All you had to do was keep your mouth shut until the, the paperwork was finished. <sighs> One week. One more fucking week, and everything that we worked for would have been a reality. One more fucking week. You shouldn't be fighting, man. We're best friends. But no more bullshit, no more ambient. It's one more week, and it's smooth sailing to a tax-exempt life, life we've been dreaming of. Oh, crap. Just okay, nothing more to add. No, you're right. I, I messed up, and I'll try better next time. It's, after all, it's what Felipe would have wanted. Who's that? No clue. I don't answer phone calls this late. You remember how I got that call? They keep calling. And? And I haven't answered. Is officially a final notice from IRS. Shit. What do we do now? You tell me. I'm at a loss. Who the fuck is here this time? Ignore it. Pretend like we're not here. We have a lot of things we gotta do. Let's just deal with whoever this is real quick. Can't think with the fucking knocking. Oh, oh, just, just tell him the barge is closed. 